What's going on, ladies and gentlemen? It's Dan here. I'd like to welcome you guys back to NBA 2K18, my career. We're moving on here. Just had a win against Cleveland. It was a really, really solid game. We're doing really, really well. As you can see, the Nets hopefully will be pretty easy to take care of. We are at home for a change. Um, well, I guess, I mean, we only have about 10 games left, I think, until we're in the playoffs. I know I've been taking a lot longer to finish this last play, but I don't know. I figured why not? You know, we got time. Anyway, let's get to practice. All right, guys, I guess nothing going on. Let's rock and roll. Back at home, so that's nice. We haven't been at home in a long time. I mean, it seems like we have more away games than home games. I mean, I think it's kind of right down the middle, right? You have just as many away games as you do home games. There's 82, 41 of those games are home, 41 of those games are away, from what I understand. But, I don't know. Kobe. Oh, I got it. Wow, I got that three. <laughs> and it was late, too. The skyline of downtown Toronto really looking wonderful tonight. It's a beautiful evening here on the shores of Lake Ontario. Hello, everyone. Welcome to another exciting broadcast of the NBA on 2K Sports. Kevin Harlan here, and I'm joined by Greg Anthony, Clark Kellogg, and David Aldridge, who's reporting from the sidelines. And back in Toronto following the road. And let's go. Right, we're ready to go, I'd say. Thank you, Kevin. Great stuff, DA. Coach Casey definitely gets the best out of his guys. You can tell they love playing for him. See, these actually I don't mind. See, these look good with the black sleeves. We got a chance here to set the floor, courtesy of Gatorade. All fueled up and ready to go for this one. Setting the floor for the Nets. Deanne Jeremy Lin, Lin Sanity. Jeremy Lin. Then there's right in Trevor the corner. Burton, and it's Hollis Jefferson in at the small forward position. Oh, I lost it. And it's out of bounds. We get the catch a break there. We don't have much time, though. Shot clock at five. Oh my god. Oh, it was a good attempt. I can't believe I didn't get that. on defense. Coming into this, having notched a win against Cleveland in their last game. No good. Executed on the road. Stayed focused. Oh, what? Stay consistent with who you are. That was random. What just happened? That, Greg. You got to do that away from home. It shows how connected they Nothing are with, with D. Russell today. That way and excellent chemistry. Lowry kicks to Quinn. Oh, come no on, bro. Good. The Nets go the other way with it. They defeated Charlotte in their last game. Yeah, unfortunately for them, I, I, I thought. Oh, I'm stuck in the middle. JV got in the way. Yeah, you wow. know what? The waters were calm for most of the game. I mean, little resistance. Felt like they could get any look they wanted. At oh, JV. Easy Lane money. There you go. Guard, if there ever was one, he wants to play downhill all the time. Explodes to the rim. And forces the defense. So I've always liked the look of black sleeves at, uh, like around the clock. I remember back in uh, like they the older the two, screen. not the older, but like 14, Russell 15, 16. The they let you customize what you wanted. You know, now you can't Over buy black Jewish sleeves around the clock. Because like the black, black, black on the ground is a good all-rounder color for so leg sleeves. And then I usually wear white well, sleeves when DJ. I'm at home. And then the colored sleeves when I'm Jewish when I'm away. Here's Gotta Quinn. pull up all Loses day. The defender with the screen and all day. The there have been a lot of great rookies in this class, but right now you gotta think that this DJ configuration actually front pretty, front pretty actually looks pretty good because I have the black sleeves. Phenomenal. It matched like my white laces Back matched my color, but it's, it's all right. I'm not, I'm actually okay with it. But the away one where we had the white sleeves, it's all messed up and Shut broken. If I, I wish I could say that's the first time I've seen that. You know you can't get a it's happened screen. in many 2K games before. But he just fails to capitalize. Don't go far, Jamie. Really frustrating missed opportunity there. Perfect screen. So easy. Finish. Aw, oh, James. He bricked it. Oh, whoops. Here's Lynn. A lot of fouls and there. It. He'll head to the line with a chance to make it three. Like how Lynn scores through contact. There we go. We can actually shake and make. Stronger than he oh, he bricks it. Incredible strength on display there. First trip to the free throw line for him. Oh my God! What is happening? And over the course of the Nets franchise history, some interesting decisions. Oh, Lynn got there. Ooh, but I still make that triple. Wow! I can't believe that. He was on the wrong side of me. I think that's why. Heavily contested. I'm baffled that we made that. Russell against DeRozan. 
shoot from the right block. Oh, there's and a foul. so he draws the foul on the shot. A trip to the line to shoot two. I gotta shake it. Kyle shake and make it. One up there. And you know, a lot of people are starting to D. Wonder, Russell couldn't Russell shoot threes for, or sorry, free throws league? for a while. Time I remember. A but he's he's improved so much as a player. Young fella from Louisville. Wells is checked in for Kyle Lowry. So, Greg, how close were the Nets to being the oh, God. Swamp Dragons anyway? <laughs> well, I was worried about that. There was too much D there. Vote of all the teams to change it, but there was one vote against it. The, the Nets themselves voted against the change, and they had seven owners who rotated nice. voting duties, and the one on deck got cold. Use the speed. Here's Quinn. Fouled. That should have gone down. Up, to get that one to go with all the hey, at least I can shoot without any cheese. You saw this team on paper at, at the beginning of the season. You had a feeling they'd have a good shot at making a run. The addition of DJ, I think, just put this team over the top. And Perfect. They have to be viewed now, I think, as a contender. And Working line, on those free throws back in the day. It's paid dividends now. Stroke, it never wavers. Passes to Hollis Jefferson. There's the screen. He dishes it to Booker. Over Valanciunas. That's short off the rim. The inside just a bit too congested for him to get the usual oh, I should have to the corner. Have with rhythm. Back. And DeRozan kicks to DJ. No, I was worried about that. that time. That's a surprise. I mean, really, there was too many defense for him to miss. Too much defense. defense too many defense. Good job, Dan. Right <laughs> too much falls. defense. And that is a shot that Hollis Jefferson continues to improve upon over time, and that's a good sign of things to come. Quinn kicks to Siakam. DeMar DeRozan on the wing. Good ball movement here by the Raptors. Screen by Valanciunas. Down low. Submit pass one more time. And it's oh, he tried. He'll take it the other way. You got to give him the credit. And let's look at the last handful of seasons and the steal numbers for Lowry. And when you see the tumble his steal totals have taken the last few years, you, you can see that he's gotten away from playing the kind of gritty, hard-nosed D he was known for. I know, I know he is stealable. His game. He oh, and I get the foul, back. I think. And a foul called on the shot. Got him on the way up that time, so he'll shoot two right here. Hey, you know, we're not really. Angela I mean, Russell I got seven points, but missteps, a lot of young I feel like we could be doing better. Brought in a controversy a couple of seasons back. That oh my God, he's going to take it. His teammates. I think he's still yes. in the process of working. To see, that's what I want to see. When Shammy's running the floor like that, Man, like he's going to pop it like every back. time. You got to respect that. Gets to a spot and scores efficiently. There's the pick. A nice shot by. Surprised he got that through. Lynn's got six points. Toronto, they've gone 50% from the field to this point, four of eight. Oh, he wasn't right. Oh, wait, he's Here's taking DeRozan. it. Come on. Oh, DeRozan. Contact there, but he gets the call and will shoot two. The title of best dunker is one that seems to change, Clark, from year to year in the NBA. Who's on your short list for that honor right now? Well, Give me me. Ways you can look at that, Kevin. The best dunker, is it the most uh, sweet-looking dunker? Is it the most forceful dunker? Is it the dunker that can do it in a game or in a contest. There are a lot of different branches on this dunk tree. Um, but for me, looks, creativity, elevation, Zach Levine oh. comes to the top of the list. I, I thought guys, he'd say DJ. That would have been awesome. Eliminate a little bit. So I go with Zach Levine and dunk me. There you go. Don't be afraid to pass it. Finishing it off. I admire that vision now. Like how DJ Because they both swarm me. Whenever they leave a man on an island like that, I'm well. going to pass it to him. Here's Lynn. That's too contested. Oh, how did they get that? Come on, guys. Felicio even got that. It goes. Felicio's got his first basket. And you just hate to JV, keep running. second chance points. Yeah, those are back crushers. I mean, they really crack your back when you give teams second shots like that. DJ kicks oh, risky pass. Chance. I'm sorry. I didn't give. I didn't. I didn't let him set the screen in time. You know what I mean? Against Charlotte, he was really on his game. Here's Alice Jefferson. DeRozan defending. Here's Booker. I'm there. Knocked loose. The Raptors have gone five nine from the field here in the first. DeRozan with it. And Quick release. Picking him up. Yes. Win. I know it was slightly late, but I was this all alone. Fast see. break. I mean, DJ firing quickly 
right off the pass, not giving the defense any time to react. And the first timeout called of the game. They for needed that. Brooklyn. Yeah, you, you can sense he wasn't happy with how things are going here. Probably looking to change it up a bit. Nothing wrong with that. You got to be flexible when something isn't working. You adjust. You modify. You go to something else. That's what the best coaches do. We played the, the Nets fairly recently, right didn't now. we? Spencer Hawes has checked in. Yeah, we chatted Jones with Russell. Units. I remember that. Here comes in for Pascal Siakam. Powell, he's checked in for Demar Derozan. And George. That's Hill a bad shot. That's right to me. I love yeah, it when the rebounds the do that. In the face, it's critical that you contest his shots every time down the floor. And yes, is good breaking through. Wow, unconscious has he been this quarter. They're riding that hot hand. Word to Big Bird. Russell kicks to Carroll. Oh, he dropped it. Good job. Here's DJ. Oh, I'm pulling up. Good. Yes. It was heavily contested, but that's my mid-range dead eye right there. Lead. They're up right now because he's been and being on the fast the break really increases your chances, like too. Catch fire like this. That momentum boost. So if you're going to shoot a three really off the fast break, is a good time to do it. I'm there, no way. Wow. Or I disagree heavily with that. Mid the defensive breakdown? Come on, Haas. I know you can set a decent screen, buddy. Yeah, all day. Give me contact, Dunks. Get that puppy. Woo! Was that Carroll who got a hand in there? I could have easily passed the Haas to get an assist, but you can't pass up a dunk opportunity like that. Got to work on that posterizer, Silver. I wonder if I can get a gold posterizer. Oh, I left him bad pass. Look at that. He got swarmed by three dudes. It's not a wrong, but look how good I'm doing. Beating Lonzo Ball, that's going to hurt. Lamar. Lamar's going to be salty about that. He's in the top spot right now, and the hardware could be his. And there's no more deserving candidate. Uh, any other outcome than him lifting that Rookie of the Year trophy, and, and I'd be shocked. Me too, Greg. I mean, the way he has sustained his level of play for the well. entire season, that's what's most impressive, the consistency of his performance. He hasn't had the major ups and downs that so many rookies go through. Levert, oh, block. Piece of it. And you love the hustle DJ brings on defense, using his solid leaping ability to block shots. I, oh my god, I got it through. DJ's got 19 That's points. remarkable. Well, if it ain't broke, 19 points in the first it. quarter. They keep getting it in the paint and continue to score consistently. They set the pick. Go ahead, pass. Here's Kilpatrick. He's guarded by Hill. They keep trying to he keeps trying to get open. They want to pass to him. Why are you the switching him? There you go, the stolen. Now the Raptors moving it up. DJ with the ball. Yep. And the Hill. Hill. There you go. Unselfishness. Woo. That was excellent. <clears throat> without any thought, without any individual agendas. Yeah, and it's really fun to see that kind of unselfishness. Really hard not to appreciate all the assists they've racked up. Crab, good. The screenplay worked ideally there, and I'm not talking, talking about, about the, the screenplay you see in a movie, movie theater. theater. <laughs> Maybe more than enough room to get that shot on. Hill dishes to Quinn. Oh, what am I stuck on? Now Hawks. I'm tired, actually. Looking for his first basket still in this one. Call that screen. Now, Pause, all DJ. you, buddy. He's guarded closely. Oh, I wish he Miss took more time. He was all alone. Fit. The defense there got away with a major lapse. Levert. Good job. I think Hill is really closing up the D nicely. Two -way player. Not only does he hustle at the offense. I'm salty that Hawes didn't just go up and dunk it or do a layup. Effort on defense. A big time effort for DJ, providing a lot of energy for Toronto. Setting up teammates and getting buckets. He is looking as determined as ever. We'll take a quick break and then back to the action here. A lot of buzz about this team's potential at the NBA Finals. Here's what DJ had to say. I mean, it feels good. It feels uh, like all of our hard work this season is paying off. I mean, there are tons 
of great teams in the league and to just be amongst them at the top means that we're doing something right. But all of that goes away if we don't finish the job. So we're laser focused. We're on a mission right now to bring back the championship and the ring home to all of our fans. DJ wants a chance to play for the title. What do you think the odds are that they get there? I mean, right now, they are playing. You have to think. Oh, my man's up here. Whoops. Get to the conference finals. From there, oh, all my fault. It just depends on how far DJ can take it. Oh, I got the. Oh. I shouldn't have done that. Folks, we'll see if we're in I should have. They, they, had to, they had to sit me. That was like, what was that? Was that second quarter? Yeah. On the sideline, let's catch up with Hall of Famer David Aldridge. Well, DJ in the last matchup against the Cavaliers. Oh, what am I jumping for? Oh, man. He ended up with 53 points. The D was good. Was diming everybody up with an incredible assist game, setting up his teammates all night long. I don't know he about that one. Big numbers and what was there you go, Siakam. Performance. Can he carry it over tonight? We'll see, Kevin. Well, considering I got 19 points guys. in the first quarter, I'd say that's pretty that good. Wow. I mean, it was really something to see. I mean, he showed everybody just how special he is when he is on his He's stuck game. in the corner. Oh, my God. He really stoked his fire. Man, there was no holding him back. And when the player is that locked in. Oh, man, I hate the hard defense like that. Enjoy the ride. Clark, you were a strong free throw shooter when you played. Why do some big men have such a hard time being at least serviceable at the free throw line? Well, I'm not as big as some of the biggest guys that have the most trouble. Typically, you see guys north of 6'8", 6'9", struggling tremendously from the line in general. And because of that, I think sometimes it's the mechanics of shooting the ball. And I should have passed it, but that's okay. I'll take that. Hindrance to that. Oftentimes, it's a matter of how much do you work at it and how soon do you start working at it. A lot of times, big guys tend to focus on their post moves and scoring the ball close to the bucket and not as much as shooting. But you're That's seeing my more board. and more big guys with sweet strokes. And I think it's a matter of, again, basic fundamentals, mechanics, and then putting in hours and hours and hours of work on it. He's taking. I'm walking away. Uh, Wells. No Wells. Nets trail by nine. If only I had gold dimer, it would have been so much better. Oh, what a block. That was pretty. Solid rebound there. And with the score like it is, that's an area where they can't afford. Sorry, JB. I was trying to set you up. Repay the big man. Column in the stat sheet that hasn't gone in their favor. Yes. They've got to put Do those all day. JB's just like getting himself in the right position. Saw the smaller man on him and took it straight to the basket. Guys are looking for a spark here. Yeah, a cold stretch offensively for sure. Here's Hollis Jefferson, guarded by Valanciunas. And while he's working on his shooting, Hollis Jefferson has shown an ability to create shots. Clark with his herky jerky drives to the cup. Herky jerky drives. With you more. He is a bit Whoa, jerky, are you serious? Tight. Get the rebound. Him to maneuver on the court. That worked very well playmate. in their favor. And the Raptors making a change here. No gear is checked in. Lavert's checked in for the Nets. I had to get through. Russell. There's the screen. Pass to Hollis Jefferson to the middle. Right Lincoln. open for Lynn. That's too easy. Lynn's got 15. Boy, I really like how Lynn positions himself. He's really good at getting to oh, the Oh, what the hell? Whoa. Pass. Now the dish to Quinn. Quick release. Nah. Another shot. And we got it. With the good. I think it's because I was on the line. I mean, different distances, your player knows how to shoot from. You know what I mean? So if I was actually further back, I think I would have been a higher chance of getting it in, believe it or not. I've noticed that. Create the space. It's better to be closer, further away from the line uh, and have more space in front of you than being closer to the line and having less, you know? You wait until the defense commits. Russell does that. Finds the open man. So easy. Get it. Finish. And there's yes. no gear up on the assist by DJ. Quinn's got six. He's too long and lanky, man. He can get it over 10. everybody. Outside Russell. Lynn kicks to Booker. Pass to Levert. One more pass. That's passing it around. Shot clock at five. Lynn. In it goes oh. for the eighth time in ten tries. And he's caught fire this quarter yet to miss a shot. Here's Quinn. Plays oh, yeah, all the way. 
DJ's got 23 points. Well, we've seen that movie a few times, haven't we? An easy bucket in the paint. Well, listless and lifeless at the defensive end. I mean, especially inside. They've really got to pick up that interior defense. Come on, guys. Good D. Here's Levert. DeRozan defending. Russell kicks to Oh, I don't know. I'm jumping. Habit, I guess. Booker with the screen for Lynn. I don't think so. It's going to be long. A putback. Oh, jeez. Put two putbacks in, in a row. In on the second chance points. And, and he wow. has really come to life here after a slow start in that first quarter. I had him a bit there. 30 seconds left to play in the first half. DJ kicks to Siakam. And he ah, could Siakam. not get that one to go. A lot of contact, and he'll go 26, so it's enough two. for a full. And he's got his first free throw of the game. Let's see what happens. Numbers this year at the line below 70, so when he's getting to the line, not nearly as effective as you'd like. And guys, it's something that he's, he's got to work on it. On more yeah, exactly. More because he's still not getting the kind of shooting percentage he would like from the line. I got him. Don't worry, I got him. A switch here. They want Carroll's that last shot. In. One second separating the shot clock and game clock. Outside, Lynn. Lynn's got to make a move. Wells with the steal. Take it rid of it, Wells. Maybe. Oh, so it was on cue, but it wasn't far lead. enough. Some breathing room heading into the break. They're playing a bruising game inside, and it's working for them. And now let's catch up with David Aldridge, who's standing by from the sideline. All right, Dave. All right, Sorry, Lolo. We'll be back after halftime for the start of the... Can't wait to turn up even more in the next half, because that's my jam, the third quarter. Now the second half about to start up and begin any moment. You look at DJ in this game, he's been everywhere. Yeah, the kind of leadership he provides, the pinpoint passing, we saw it all there on display in that first half. Yeah, he enjoys teen. I like it when I turn up, him in the first half. Like it's a good sign. You and I both like to hit that oh, reaching foul, my bad. Some players aren't reachinable, so I'm going to stop there. reaching. No doubt about it. And you know what? Did, did you bring your clubs, Clark? Yeah, check and see if I can get us a tee time tomorrow morning. All right. So for Brooklyn now, Trevor Booker is out there with Hollis Jefferson. And there's D'Angelo. Oh, he Russell. got it. Then it's Jeremy Lee. It's Lynn, only a two, though. And it's Felicio in at the pivot spot, manning the middle. Wow, that's that's real nice. I mean, D'Angelo really sets before he gets into his shot. All right, shot. James. Good use of pace there. Got to slam it. Uh. it down Woo. I could have easily passed it off, but I'm rap. slamming it. Insane dunk. And now they're starting Too much to space. Build up a lead. I feel like I pass go. it Maybe when it I don't need time. posterizing. You know what I mean? The wound, the more or when like it's like gonna, that, I might get blocked. The more they'll have these guys reeling and on the ropes. Booker, oh man, I was like right with him. Now here is Russell. Back to win. Puts up a. I'm three. there. Rebound by the Raptors. Alan Junis has got rebound number nine now. What an effort here tonight. DeRozan passes to Quinn. He was actually pretty far, but he moved in there. Alan Junis with a screen on Lynn. Back Leaving him. DeRozan. DeRozan. Releases That's money. 15. Already and no. It's Toronto converted. That's his and money DJ's spot. A rock solid pass. Has a good feel for who to get the ball to. I like getting these assists early. Outside, Lynn. The feeds are Russell. Oh, I can't believe I didn't get a hand on it. I think the angle is too sharp. He kicks it to Booker. Screened by Russell. He's got to do Booker something with it. Pass to Hollis Jefferson. The Nets need to get a shot off here. And that wow. They made it. And that's I don't think I was close enough to him. Boy, he's been excellent thus far. Lynn's been playing yeah, quite well. Still hasn't been enough to get them the lead. I see you, Lowry. Lowry That's money. Ah. Rebound, Brooklyn. I got to possibly got that rebound. That was wide open. Down. No defender in sight. Whatsoever. Okay, let's check in with David Aldridge, who's reporting from the sideline. Hey, a good okay, D. It may not be the era of the center in the NBA, but Jonas Valanciunas has something to say about that. He said, yes. Try to make sure they don't forget Push it about through. Centers. We're 75% from the field goal. The league is full That's of pretty guys good. That can do different things. But I still think you need a center that can rebound the ball and score in the low post. Word. Kevin? 
Now the centers are still important, David. Good to see Valanciunas making his presence felt in the paint. Spencer Hawes has checked in for Pascal Siakam. Russell passes to Hollis Jefferson. Back to Russell. They set the pick. Oh, wide open. Oh, but he blocks it. And sends it back. Lowry kicks to Quinn. Oh, I didn't want to pass yet. Good My bad. Here by the Raptors. Oh, no. Out to the wing. Or Quick the release. Booker oh, it looked it good. In. Booker's got three I wanted to get rid of it quick, but I wasn't one. set. If my, if my feet and were you know, set, Kenny it would have gone down. Because I have that corner three, but I'm never in the three, corner for three that much. playing career was over, he went right into coaching. Booker Careful, Oz. On Russell from long range. Ooh, dirty. Drains it from beyond the arc. Russell's got eight points. Sizes it up. Russell wisely takes it himself. Lowry kicks to DJ. Sagan. From deep. Gets it to yep. go from beyond the arc. Quinn's got the lead up to 12 now for the Raptors. They were sagging off me, and so Atkinson pop that three, baby. Four years as an assistant in Paris. Four years in New York. So I'm two Knicks. for four from three. Came from Atlanta, where he was a big time assistant and well thought of by fellow Hawk players. Yeah, you know, and after a decade. I'm having a good time with this game. Kevin, it feels, it feels good. Like things are working team, out. So he's had a vast reservoir of experience. All right, Haas, come over here, buddy. On the sidelines as a coach, and now he's got to pass of course, it. Leading the Brooklyn Nets. Get rid of it, Haas. Haas. Last it's year, it's not assist because he took too really, long with it. Really got a chance Whatever. To be we got the points. As a coach and leader. Oh, he dropped it. Get it, get it, get it. Oh, my God. Pause. Finish. Pause. He boxes it. He feeds it to DJ. To the paint. Why would I pass there? I passed left. It's because he caught. What a waste of a possession, Lowry man. Against Russia. Some rim that was ridiculous. In, and the bucket's good. We could have gotten an easy two Russell's points. Russell's got seven points here in this quarter. Outside DeRozan. DeRozan's cutting. From the baseline. James. Wow. Oh, oh man, that looked pretty good. You're not going to see that very often. Plenty of space, but he just, let's face it, he whiffs on that one. Russell with it. Lowry picks him up. Passes to kill Patrick. I was trying to go to him a bit. Not oh, exactly what three. I wanted. Leading by 10. I'm on the wrong side. Lowry kicks to Hawks. Dishes it to Grimm. Nice move. Hand off on the way. That was DJ's pretty. Got 32 points. I tell you, he's beating up the defense in this quarter, going right at him and scoring in a variety of ways. Yes, sir. Outside Russell. A lot of dribbling going on from D. Russ. The pass to Hollis Jefferson. Six on the shot clock. 13 feet away. Get in there to make and it harder. Comes off the front of the rim. Obviously, I mean, it would go a long way if he's making his shots. Right now, they're behind, and they certainly could use his help. I messed that one up. Lowry. And here is Okay, Haas, you ready? He's got 32. Screw it. Uh, it down too many, too much space, man. Confidence on the drive. DJ is great at finding holes in the defense. It's not a guarantee that... Pause is going to do 14. anything with it. They've been struggling here on offense. Yeah, I'm not cooking right now, though. For sure. So anything could happen. Timeout called the Nets. Clark is an analyst. Do you feel you view the game drastically different from when you were in your playing days in college and the NBA? Yeah, you know what, Kevin? I really do because I've benefited from the different coaches we've had a chance to visit with over the years, and I'm that's added to my perspective. I um, mean, you tend to look at things differently when you're playing. Oh, he stepped out of bounds. The game, but oh. I think I've become a lot more That's analytical geez. as an analyst, <laughs> if that makes any sense. Yes. The Raptors making a switch here. Nogueira has checked in. Raptors leading by 14. Kicks to DJ. He was sagging. I, I, I took too long. Foul, and no and one, but I'll take the foul. Looked like a blocking foul, and he was uh, in the shooting motion. So he'll head to the free throw line. First of all, I really respect how DJ plays the game. I mean, yeah, he was all over me. Got a fairly laid back attitude, but it's a calming, confident presence on the court. First free throw is good. Fertile, he is checked in for Toronto. And both free Money. throws good for DJ. Nets trail by 16. Sorry, baby, I kind of cut him off there. 
There's the pick. Feeds to Cram. A floater. And he oh, sets man. Who's decent Krabs defense, got too? Six. Nice looking floater there, Kevin. Such a fast shot, a quick release. Really hard to guard that. Hurdle. To the right side. Here's quick. DJ. Oh, it was looking right kind of sketchy, but uh, yeah, that's just poor decision making. Hey, that would have been okay. Be better in those situations. Greg, I just think he was in a hurry. He flat out rushed it. I mean, I don't know what he was thinking there. He actually was in a brain neutral position. Relax, man. It wasn't that bad. That's good. Wow. Babe. He's fouled pretty hard on that shot, but he's got the chance to pick up the See, things like the that. Line. Clearly a foul. Yeah, he took a shot there. Earned those free throws. Damn. And look at how the offensive approach has been going here so far for the Raptors. I need to get more assists, like though, guys. They've taken the high percentage shot in the paint. In that first half, we saw them doing it, and they've continued to succeed as the game has worn on. They've consistently drilled the mid-range jumper tonight as well, which has forced the D to come out on. Here's Russell. That's too much defense. Oh, he made it. Good off the front iron. Russell's got 12 points here in the second half. And I thought the defender played that one pretty well, but Russell with that quick trigger release like a staple gun. Here's DJ. Hits the yes. Point See, I like to take my time with it when they're sagging that bar. In the third for Toronto. And he's finally getting three the for six from beyond. His second three of the half right there. Don't reach. Just stay with him. I see the screen. Levert, defended by Quinn. I jumped early. Oh, then Pirtle gets my back. Deserves a lot of credit for his shot blocking ability. He's a dynamic and dynamite shot blocker. All right, hang tight. Back it up. I want like a lot of runway. Here's DJ. Pirtle. He's got 39. Oh, He's see, that's why I don't always Carroll. pass the Pirtle. I could have taken that jumper. To the paint. Oh. Here's Crab. And it's DJ. Oh, how did I get the board? Ball. I can't believe it. After Through all those guys. It's crazy. One forty-four left to play. Powell, I'm walking away. No. The shot by Powell, no good. Brooklyn's gone two. No one, none of my teammates can score up a pass for me. Since coming out of the break, a nice shot. I was on the wrong side of him. Like the way Levert controls himself, always under control, knows what he's looking for, takes his time, particularly when he's close to the basket. So timeout called here. The first for Toronto. Some changes for Toronto. Valanciunas comes in for Jakob Pertl. And it's Pascal Siakam in for Lucas Nogueira. And a switch here for Brooklyn. Jimmy uh, Lynn has checked in for Russell. For Toronto, they've gone better than 53% from the floor since halftime. Shooting 8 of 15. And for D'Angelo Russell, Damn, they're holding the me offensive up. talent is obvious. But it seems as defense, Clark has a ways to go. Well, he's got the packet now. He's got good... No! Guys. Oh, man, that was my wrist. Oh, he's a geez. good athlete, but not an he explosive, in a weird way. powerful athlete. I think he's got to get stronger. Crab's got that. Easy. Pieces, oh, did I get that really board? I did. Hell! And the consistent oh, he's taking it! Day in and day oh! Out to maximize his, his oh, that's money. I love those kind of plays. Looks. I mean, the defense has to be more aggressive guarding the perimeter. Lynn with it. 19 points in the game. Oh, don't that's enough space for him. Oh, he didn't make it. Powell pulls it the in. volleyball. Tell you what, Kevin, they will take that look every time. Limited defense, great. Pulling shot. up. That's my shot Just all day. You live with those. He's working on that difficult shots badge as well off the dribble. A lot of confidence. And sinking a lot of Difficult shots. shots, gold. Honestly, you can just pull up quickly. Here's Don't let them get Crab. situated. Whoa, how is that not a and foul? Toronto with and I got rebound. the board. DJ's got four rebounds in this game. It's just one oh, he dropped it. I was, so I was about to call for Nothing it back. Nothing seems to be finding the bottom of the net. Oh. oh. The foul on top of it. So strong. He and is Levert strong. I should have just put a hand up. In transition. Incredibly quick in the open floor. And he's got his first chance it's at the shame. line here. He's hit his free throws at a pretty good clip this year, 77%. You know, there's been some improvement in his free Foul and one, this easy. Oh, I was too open, too, like nobody was in front of me. Last season. And not quite as aggressive from outside as they were in the first half, sticking to the high go. percentage shots, playing smart with I'm the I'm cooking lead. now, but the, th the quarter's almost over. It'll reset your cookingness. Outside, Lynn. Over Hill. 
And That's my board. Comes up a bit short. And so it's At least I got another rebound. In command with a 16-point lead as the buzzer sounds. They've been putting on a clinic in the paint. Shots uh, are falling with regularity. It's crazy a guy so small can get that dunk. Low. That's we why when smaller guys can dunk, it's remarkable. Right this. I remember Nate Robinson. He was pretty short, too. I think he was only about 5'9". And thanks again for joining us. Let's see what happens here in the fourth. All right, guys, let's Raptors rock. Leading by 16. They've got Hill. He's out there with DJ. Jonas Valanciunas is out there with Norman Powell. And it's Siakam in a power forward. So that's the fourth. All day, baby. For Toronto. The, the defense has just been unable to slow him down. Wow. What a game. There's a good screen. Lynn kicks to Felicio. And oh, that what a DJ. snag. And here we go. Fast break. DJ's got it. Oh, no. They stopped the fast break. Wait a minute. I'm still cooking. Doubled. It's back to Hill. There's Javes. Finish. And it's we got the points. That time on the assist by Hill. I Hill's just wish I was a bit faster on that one end. Nets trail by 20. Now Lynn. Carroll with a screen on Hill. Now here's Lynn. Block at six. Now they got to do something with it. I'm blocking all chances for them to get a pass off. Over Hill. And they settle. Bounces high but he gets it. The rim and drops. Wow, that was 21 lucky. 21 points for Lynn. And Lynn heats up in a hurry now. He has devastating solo spurt ability. No one's there. All okay, day. No oh my gosh. 49 points for DJ. 49 he knows points. how to get it done. He knows what he's doing out there. A nice job from the three-point line this half. I am cooking. That's why I took that three. Stripped. And Grab it. Stolen by DJ. Just put it down. Good. Yep. And Hill picking up the assist. Woo! 51 points. And it's the start of the, the fourth. That's the crazy and thing. And defensively, guys, they've been unable to shut down the middle. Yeah, and they're really getting pummeled on points in the paint here. And illegal screen? Yeah. The illegal kick was set. Yep, that's right. On that me. That's what I thought. That's only the first turnover, guys. He's been safe as Dude, an Dude, this game is awesome. At the offensive end. DeMar DeRozan. All right, let's call a screen here. Toronto. They set the pick. Oh, I lost it, but we're good. Yes. Terrific assist. Clean. That's what I wanted to do anyway. All around. And not hard to see why they are giving up points on this run. Just too many. Oh man, it's just a murder. I just realized it's 25 points up right now. We got to get our squad some timbits. Already had 100 points in seven minutes 50 seconds. How do you think that has changed the NBA? Well, I think it's enhanced the NBA's product on the floor because again, you're getting the best players in the world that are competing in the NBA with the international influx. I think it's added to the global pop popularity of the league without question the NBA is clear in that we're going far and wide across the globe to find the best are you pulling me why play in the best league. wow they kept me off man I don't need that much rest but you bench me for most of the of second since the start of the fourth quarter now I'm not cooking anymore I don't know why they do that there's a screen I'm stuck oh they switched us Lynn. Pass to Kilpatrick. Don't Just jump on him. Why'd I jump? Looking I'm stuck. The run. Can't hit that one. Now Toronto takes it the other way. And a big lead for them on both the scoreboard and the backboard thus far. Bit of a sag, yeah, but he's coming up. Been a big key in this one, Greg. Oh, man, he's not set. Wheel and have taken control on the yes, glass. finish. Easy. Nice shot by That's what I was waiting hey, on. When Pirtle gets the rock deep inside, the defense is cooked. Can't allow him to get comfortable from there. Here's Kilpatrick, guarded by Powell. Here's the screen. Outside, Russell launches it. I was there. It's hauled in by the Raptors. And the Raptors with possession. They've got a 13-2 run goal. Oh, I got blocked. Back by Russell. Russell got the block, really? And here we go, Brooklyn fast break. I'm nowhere near Brooklyn's him. Running. 
Oh. Again, Russell missing. Man, right play. Run it, run it, Sham. Run it. One. Take it. Generally, you knock those down. Not much else oh, you I was can hoping do there. for that. I mean, that's what you want. Too bad they weren't able to finish it off. No other way to put it. Just a poor shooting performance for him. But luckily, his teammates have picked up the slack. Officials have been scrutinizing. Oh, wait a minute. Players, you don't you shouldn't have left them. Coaches and analysts alike for as long as the games have been played. Clark, just how hard is it to be an official in the NBA? Kevin, harder than I can really articulate. When you think about the number of calls, the speed and strength and athleticism. Oh, fouled the hard. Players, the dimensions of Two the shots, court being such a confined space for Two. 10. Let they get those chants in there. Powerful players. All of that speaks to me in this way. The NBA officials Four for seven. That's not bad for three. They make mistakes. 21 of 29. All that's also really good. Make mistakes, and that human element should always be part of the game. I like technology Amazing. aiding the officials. But I don't ever want to see us eliminate. I don't like right now. It showed that Curry was in the lead for MVP, Looking but I don't know how that's possible at this the point. Allen's checked in for Jeremy Lin, and Damari Carroll subbed in for Levert. I see it. I saw it. No strip with the steal. Go Sham. And here is Wells. He wasn't doing anything with it. Double to the middle. All day. All day. Yes. Careless with the ball there and the turnover. They just ditched him. The big stuff. Once he came up right with the steal, he went straight on the attack. That's exactly the way to do it too, Kevin. Go hard to the bucket and don't let them set up the defense. I'm like good for like rest too. They like I haven't been screen. sprinting like crazy. I haven't needed to. Here's Kilpatrick. I got in there. Here's Allen. Oh, what a block. And as we head to the final buzzer here, a crushing blowout. Big time Ooh, and one. There you go. The With the dunk. What was Carroll doing? Toronto. You don't see this kind of a blowout. Let's get some more MVP tonight. chance. Why not? This is a quality win across <laughs> the board to deliver out. Uh, <laughs> Look at my field goal percentage. It's so good. 73%? I'm just drinking in the MVP chance. I love it. Single category. Look at that, they're chanting it, that's awesome. <laughs> you can see them. And that's great. Dominance continues, guys, as they sweep the season series. Four games to match. That's impressive on one side, but embarrassing on the other side, Greg. And what a tremendous standout performance it was for DJ. I'll Just say. Just outpouring the points from him. Nobody could do much to keep him. I don't know how that wasn't an over and in. back. Now, here is Russell. He's covered by Quinn. Offensive rebound. Oh, but they get the board. The shot is good. Uh, how about the perseverance there? The extra effort on that offensive glass. Yep. <laughs> I just pushed my way through. And that's a killer instinct on display as they try to put this one. 58. Can we get 60? And, you know, this is what's needed at this point in the game, Greg. The great teams know how to close it out. 46 seconds left in the fourth. There's the pick. And he oh, went in, hey. Drilling the rim on the way down. You know, they, we're I'm about cooking, so my chances are pretty high to get another set. That Russell has. I'm trying to find that with my golf swing, fellas. Mm -hmm. uh, because of his stroke, yep. though, he can be rough all day. <laughs> He's found it before you, Clark, for sure. <laughs> Look at that. There's three what, of us that are cooking. Well, I was cooking. This arena. You can feel it. Big time. I mean, it's amazing. Their crowd letting them hear it. And that's always inspiring. They want to see this thing get wrapped up. Double. Now, here's DJ. I want to Pirtle, actually. Double again. Win kicks to Pirtle to the wing right side. Not oh, I dropped loose. it. Oh, I was going for one more to get to 60. By a big margin. They poured it out a night. Dominant showing. In wow, front of what a game. Every minute of it. And you know, this game could really be. Those things are worth a lot, the contested mid range. Still don't have Tyler score. I hope I'd be able to get the gold. Almost at teardrop as well. I can't believe I don't have that yet. Oh, right, I recently got glue hands. 
Perimeter shots, five for nine. That's worth a lot. I'd say this was one of my better games. Look at that, 20,000? Holy. DJ, great Hello, game. Uh, the guys back in the studio want to do an interview with you. Nice. The 2K Sports Post Game Show. And we welcome you back. I'm Ernie Johnson. We got Shaq here. We got Kenny here. With this one in the books, we've got a special post game guest joining us. Hi, this is Shaq. Look, you know I like the score. But I love the shot creation you provided. How did you balance between creating for yourself and for others as well? Well, Shaq, I just I try to never let the defense get comfortable with what I'm going to do with the ball. You know, when they can guess what you're looking to do, it, it makes defending a lot easier. Uh, you know, the balance of creating shots for myself and others come from what the defense is willing to give to me. Steph Curry, he's coming for you. I'm coming, baby. Well, that's, you, wrap, everybody. that's super true, though, guys. Like, I mean, that's exactly what I was trying to do. Like, they, once they start seeing it and you take advantage of the fact, they're like, oh, he's going to shoot it. Nope, passing it. So what is he going to do? Is he going to pass or shoot? You don't know. So it keeps them guessing, so leaving a lot of openings. And that's exactly what happened in this game. It was a dominating performance, and I absolutely loved it, man. This was such a fun game to play. Too bad I didn't get a trip dub. All right, ladies and gentlemen, so that is going to be it for this one. Excellent game. Really enjoyed it. Hope you guys did as well. If you enjoyed this one, do me a favor. Hit that like button. Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. And if you haven't yet, be sure to like follow my pages on social media, facebook.com slash DanQ8000. For live streams and other content, Twitter, DanQ8000, Instagram, DanQ8K, and Snapchat, DanQ8000. If you want to get yourself a shirt or hoodie, there's a link to my shop in the description below. If you want to save 10% off your next DX Racer, link in the description. Be sure to use the promo code DanQ8000 at checkout. All right, guys. Thank you so much again. Take it easy. Have a wonderful day. I'll be Seeing you soon for more content, but until then, let's hand things over to Knox Hill. Have a good one, guys. So back, yeah, give me that bow in your lane like a trap train. Give me that ah, hell nah, they ain't running like this. I'm a marathon bitch, man, the errors line act like a rock. We ain't moving, you know me, been chilling at the top. This the type of feel you only feel it when you hide. NBA 2K on the dot. Drop it.